The Shenyang J-16 is a Chinese twin-engine, multi-role fighter jet. J-16s are also frequently deployed in the Taiwan Strait and around the island during exercises and incursion around Taiwan, often crossing the median line which usually is considered as a boundary. China's aerospace industry has eclipsed Russia regarding capabilities and production numbers, a trend that has been a long time in the making, but one that began with the Shenyang J-16. The J-16 has a similarly long range, high weapons capacity, and large and powerful radar to the J-20, but is a heavily enhanced fourth-generation design benefiting from a number of fifth-generation technologies developed for the J-20. J-16s also have six wing-mounted hardpoints, allowing them to carry infrared-guided air-to-air missiles or air-to-ground munitions. J-16 units have received radar-absorbent paint to reduce its radar signature and enhance its suppression of enemy air defense's capability in conjunction with electronic support measures pods. With enhanced electronic warfare and surveillance capabilities, the J-16 provides the PLAAF with a versatile, high-performance fighter for modern air combat scenarios. China, facing the Western arms embargoes that followed the suppression of the Tiananmen Square protests, turned to Russia and in 1992 became the first export customer of the flanker. China is working to field a credible power projection capability that can directly challenge the United States far away from China's border, and the J-16 is emblematic of that desire and a crucial piece of the power projection puzzle. The J-16 is a copy of the Soviet Union's MiG-19, a single-seat, twin-engine fighter that made its debut in the mid-1950s. For the United States, the forward deployment of J-16s introduces an additional layer of deterrence. The U.S. Navy and Air Force routinely conduct freedom of navigation operations to challenge China. China is trying hard to modernize and fill in their need for fourth-generation fighters, meanwhile working very hard every way possible to develop its fifth-generation fighter capability. With production numbers currently estimated at well over 350 fighters, this makes the J-16 by far the most widely commissioned heavyweight fighter class by a single air force anywhere in the world since the turn of the century. J-16 holds advantages over Russian flanker variants with its wide application of composite materials, longer range missiles, advanced sensors, and avionics. As recently as five years ago, the Russian and Chinese air fleets were broadly similar in several regards. Moscow and Beijing relied heavily on the flanker family of aircraft, the then backbone of their respective air power. The fighter was provided to the People's Republic of China, where at least 2,000 were manufactured under license by the Shenyang Aircraft Corporation. The J-6 was China's first supersonic fighter jet. The J-16 Hidden Dragon fighter jet is developed by the Chinese Shenyang Aircraft Corporation. The company built both civilian and military aircraft for China, and it is one of the oldest aircraft manufacturers in the country. Ultimately, the deployment of J-16s to the Paracels represents a tangible shift in the South China Sea's security dynamics. By reinforcing its military footprint on disputed territories, China's refueling tactics during the joint patrols also drew criticism. The Yu-20 tankers operated dangerously close to the Miyako Strait, within range of Japan's Type 12 surface-to-air missiles and Aegis destroyers. The all-weather, multi-role fighter can carry out air-to-air -air and air-to-surface deep interdiction missions. Currently, China and its neighbor India possess the Russian fighter jet. The J-16 is a superior to all types of aircraft I have flown. Speaking of the control capacity of the aircraft, the J-16 is a 3.5-generation plane with huge breakthroughs in radar and fire control systems. The Chinese military is developing advanced autonomous capabilities for its combat aircraft. In March 2021, it was reported that a J-16 variant with the backseat co-pilot replaced by an artificial intelligence. The J-16 was first flown around 2011 to 2012, and the first production planes reached the PLAAF in August 2014, reaching full service in 2015 and being officially revealed in 2017. China has several different stealth aircraft in service that play various roles though their performance and the quality of their stealth capabilities are still the subject of intense debate. It is designed to operate in both air-to-air -air and air-to-ground combat, with the flexibility to conduct various missions in contested environments. Based on the Russian Su-30 MKK, 
the J-16 incorporates advanced Chinese-made avionics. J-16 units have received radar-absorbent paint to reduce its radar signature and enhance its suppression of enemy air defenses.